after hearing your story, seeing how you, after we talked the other day, you left the roof and you found this magical thing underneath the stairs. And the next morning you wake up having visions of blood running down your face and visions of spaceships and monsters and things like that. Throwing your, your damn brother across the living room once he makes you mad and also beating me in a foot race, which I still can't believe. Uh, I decided that I talked to my boys down to my station and uh, you know they hooked me up with the with the suit for you, man. This suit stands for a symbol. I told you a while ago, man, that you're worth more than what you know. You said that darkness is coming or something like that. And I know whenever they come, you'll be the hero that protects us from all that. Damn it. You don't like it, do you? No. I love it. What's best for you that makes them cool and you a fool Your family only nice to you So soon they'll get some cash from you If they think I'm too young to understand And they get damn fool I'm wild, biggest fan No, I ain't wild, biggest fan No, I'm wild, biggest fan Please, he's selling out shows right now Back to back to back I mean, these two came from living in a house With his four, with his other three brothers and now he's doing big things on tour and he, he's just rocking it right now i mean i can't wait till his mixtape comes out but the downloads on itunes are going ballistic man we, we can't stop the I told y'all leave me alone, man. Y'all better be gone. Yeah, just leave me alone. Why are you still talking? Just leave me alone. Yeah, leave me alone. Just leave me alone. Superstar, I'm doing pretty good, man. Show, show, I'm better than I expected. I guess. Hey, we've been watching you do your thing, man. And I must say, we're all proud of you. Very proud of you. I'll get it. Actually, we do, man. We, we recently just got a fourth roommate, and to be honest, man, I don't think he'll have a problem with lending the superstar his room for about, let's say, a million dollars. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, what's Broke Reggie? Uh, Broke Reggie? Uh, 
let's just say uh, he's a little busy at the moment. Yeah, very busy. Yeah, I totally understand, man. Hey, but let him know. Let him know I said I love him, man. Uh, I'll see him soon. Will do, man. I'll definitely deliver the message to him. But uh, just know that we all love you, man. We're all proud of you and can't wait to see you in a few weeks. All right. Take care, my brother. Hey, bro, Reggie. Hey, bro, Reggie. Come on out here, man. You got some mail. Where is it? It's right over there. Hey, bro. I just want to apologize, hey. bro. Just know that I love you too. And I'm also sorry for what I did to you. I love you too, man. Cool. Hey, Radio Reggie. Radio, Reggie. Can I can I see you in here for a minute, man? What's up, bro? Have you talked to Nicole lately? No. I figured that. Cause I have. What? No, don't 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 talk. Just listen. That girl loves you, man. Your brother in there is becoming something that I can't even understand. I can hold my own. So can you. I mean, you could be the best radio show host anywhere, man. Why not go overseas with her? Go to another country. Have a family. Live life. Because mom's dying wish may have been for us to stay together no matter what. But that doesn't mean that we can't stay together right here, man. <laughs> Look, man. Uh, she's been texting me and letting me know that you haven't been responding or returning any of her phone calls. So she wanted me to let you know that uh, she's waiting for you right now and where you guys first met. Take that into consideration. So I heard you were looking for me. Yeah, I've been calling you, but. You haven't picked up. I mean, you s seem like you had your mind made up about leaving the country for your new job, so who mm. can blame me? Well, I've been doing a lot of thinking, and um, they gave me an extension to make up my mind. And make up your mind for what, Nicole? Well, I was thinking, and I mean, you're a good radio show host, and you can get a job wherever you want it, and. I was hoping you would come with me. Reggie, we have been watching you. We've noticed that you have special abilities like us. Yes, us. 
We are an organization that remains unknown to the world, but known to all evil who plans to destroy planet Earth. We need your help to stop the army of darkness. If you come join us, we will help you master your skills and mold you into become something that is rarely mentioned ever. A legend. But do realize if you accept this offer, there will be tons of consequences that may come along with it. Seeing that you will pose as a threat to all evil, they will do whatever it takes to defeat you. They will aim for those who are very close to you. This may cause your loved ones to leave by their own choice. someone else's. We have arrived. Our plan is to wipe out all of those who have abuse their privilege while living here on Earth. That is everyone. And now we are hearing that there are heroes out there looking to save this corrupt and evil world. <laughs> uh, why save what doesn't want to be saved? We welcome them to face us, even though we are victorious before we step onto the battlefield. We will hide in the shadows and slowly get our message out to all of you here on Earth. And that message is, the time may be now, but ours.